we're going to talk about feelings, emotions, sadness, emotions. Hello and welcome to Beef Gravy Studios. I am your host, Beef Gravy, and the guy whose phone is going off at the at the wrong time. <laughs> it's seven o'clock. Is little beef. It's my, seven o'clock. Yeah, great. My original employee of Beef Gravy Studios, and today we are playing Talk to Me Personality Test. Now. The guy with all the personality here, Little Beef, is going to take that test. And it's probably some analog horror or something like that. We got it for free off itch. Little Beef, tell the folks at home their, your thoughts. I think we're going to get spooked. And it's 7 o'clock our time. I have to apologize again. <clears throat> Unfortunately, there's no possible safe function in this game yet. There are several endings. Every ending doesn't really take long. And in your future, I release another update where you can save your scores and your endings. Have fun playing, oh, I will. So all you need to play this one is to like hit enter and left and right arrows. Left and right, okay, enter and left and right arrows. Yes. This kind of indie horror game happened when you're deserving. Following games fictional and made up. I will go off of it. Alright. Best experience. We're headphones. We're not. No. We got a big old microphone. Oh, we have microphones. Yes. Losers. Our game. Or our pirate. <laughs> or maybe it's Rockstar. It's not Rockstar. Talk, Talk to, to me, me. Uh, personally. <laughs> analog horror, just the way you like it. Me like horror. Alright. Alright. All you gotta do is hit, yeah, you don't use a mouse. Oh. Start. Do, do, do. You just use one hand, you know that, right? Do, do, do. Loading, loading, loading. Loading is for losers. Press enter to con okay. Okay. Hi. Stop it. What are you, Kermit the Frog? Dude. <laughs> oh, <it> stinks. <laughs> oh my god. I hope the microphone picked that up. I, I hope you are well. Whoa. May I ask you a few questions? No. Some of the questions are very personal. <laughs> it's a very, well, it's a personality test with personal questions. Personal. Pup, pup, pup. Who wants to get to know you? Ooh, knowledge. You know better. Oh, get to know me better. <laughs> a few questions. Start. Very simply. Do you have gluten free allergies? What is your What's name? What's your name? Tony! Attention. Please, no couple of letters. Presenter. Steven? Steven. That's Steven. Ha <laughs> S T E V E N. Alright. Steven. Steven, Steven, right? You're Steven, right? <laughs> yes. So you have to hit enter so, you know, in those little smiley faces and. So now you want to start the personality spot. test. Steven, do you have any fears? You can go left to right. Yeah, there's one over there. Uh, no. I think you got to hit enter again. So would you say that right now? How you how? Are, you're not afraid. Well, you don't need to be afraid either. So, I won't hurt you. Oh, that doesn't... Others may hurt you. Um... We just want to hope nobody hurts you. Oh, really? But don't worry. Make sure nobody harms you. Well, it's just... I, I hope... It's just a personality test. Did we get hurt during this? You know what else is a personality test? My insurance! Alright, it's cold outside, it's snowing, as a black car drives down a dark night into up a street and there are no traffic lights or signs. But apartments everywhere and houses, the street has two lanes, both sides, both sides. Black car wants to turn right at the intersection. Suddenly a woman comes around the corner in a complete black jacket. There's a lot of black. Yes, it is. She probably wants to cross the street. Even though there's a traffic light seven meters in front of her, she wants exactly where it's most dangerous. So she's jaywalking. She's putting herself in harm's way. 
Now the car hits... See? The car hits her. The driver couldn't see the woman. It was pitch black in exactly the intersection the woman is crossing the street. But even though it was dark, there was a traffic light seven meters away. Is the driver's fault? And now I want you who is at blame. I'm going to say it's the pedestrian, not the driver, because she did not cross where she should. That's why those are there. On your driver's test, too. What do you mean? You're supposed to cross where it says cross. You seem to be a very interesting person. That's judgmental. Oh. Oh. Bob oh. Ross, Bob Ross, Bob Ross, Bob, Bob, sus. sus. <laughs> Welcome back, Stephen. We never left. We just had a technical error in the system. Ooh, spooky! Just continue with the tech. Uh. Which picture is more to be more afraid of? A woman or a man, baby? Come on, are you afraid of girls? <laughs> oh, really? I'm not afraid of girls. All right, Steven. All right. Oh. Which picture are you more afraid of? That one. I'm chiming in. All right, Steven. Ugh. Ugh. Uh. Yeah. Which one? Which no one? eyes. No eyes, no eyes, you've got no eyes. Steven? Computer? You know that I will protect you, right? You've got uh, two, two options. Yes. Really? I don't think he will. Ooh, spooky. I think he's looking to spook you. He's looking to give me a seizure, like I'm an old person. Okay. Well, that's good. Now, S Stephen, I will play a few seconds for you to decide if you feel uncomfortable. Oh, no. Sound number one, please. Enter and play the sound. Sound number two, press enter. Are you scared? Not really. Sounds just like a giant jet flying over a house or something. Did you know that there's mood lighting in cars? Yes. Okay. No. Oh. You just picked noise one. All right. Is there a reason, reason you, you chose this sound? I'm afraid of this sound. There, there is no reason. Mm -mm. All right, then. Do 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 Sad face. <laughs> I guess he didn't like it. What did we fail? No, no reason. reason. Oh no. Sad face. Oh no. Okay, I will play you two more sounds and then tell me how you feel when you hear these. Oh no. Sound number two, press on, okay, okay. Can't really hear the sound. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Hang on. Really? Which one is it now? Noise one or... Two? Okay. Uh, I felt like noise one. Does that make you feel yes. a little scared? Nope, not. Did you go with <laughs> nope, not really. <laughs> I think he's trying to scare you. Why? 
because it's an analog horror game. All right, so we uh, took the personality test, and the game just kind of ended. He said there really was there were also endings, but the game doesn't like end on its own. So, what did you think overall? How they did set the mood good, spooked you a little bit? A little bit, but I wish there was an actual ending to the ending that we didn't get the ending to. <gasps> so you're saying you would like there to be a screen at the end that says, "Hey, I'm the end." No, I just wanted to say the end or end. That's what I just said. Oh yeah, you did. Um... You know what? Analog horror. It was good.